Hey guys, welcome to the second part of this tutorial, the auto clicker app. So uh, today we're going to be turning the actual script into an application that you can open and uh, download and send to other people. So just real quick, I added text to dot focus down here just uh, because then when you open the application, it focuses your mouse on the text entry like it puts the little typing uh, icon and then I also added all these comments because having comments is just easier so I know where's the text labels title buttons and yeah I just moved the title down here from up here and that's basically it for this and then basically if you see right here we have a shortcut so basically this is the app uh, after turning the script into the .exe so we open it no command line no nothing just a pure app uh, so it still works. I'll show you right now. I can start the bot. Uh, this is just our testing app, we can say. And there we go, I'm spamming it. And I can stop it with the click of the key we designated. And then I can choose like a delay. So let's do two seconds. And then it clicks and one, two clicks. So yeah, everything still works. And I can stop it with the key. And there we go. So yeah, and sometimes, by the way, if like you start it and it never actually starts clicking and it crashes, just restart it and try again. It happens sometimes. I really don't know why. Uh, I don't know if it's from the PC or the code, but yeah, either way, let's get into the tutorial on how to turn any Python script into an exe file. Hey guys, welcome back. So uh, let's get straight into it. So we're going to do this on uh, our auto clicker bot that we made last time, but you can do it on any Python script. Uh, you just need to have a terminal and uh, internet connection. So in the terminal, what you want to type is pip install auto pi 2 exe. So you're going to do this. It's already installed on mine, so it's not going to take long at all, but just wait till it finishes installing. And then you just want to type auto pip to exe. And, uh, oh wait, no, not pip, sorry, pi to exe, my bad. And that's going to open up this window. So you're going to need to put your script location. So, or you can copy paste it, or you can just browse and uh, it's already going to put me right here. And, uh, yeah, so let me go to my file, clicker bot. So you take your Python script, the one that we made the clicker bot on, and you click open. So that's already done. And then if you want to only upload one script, then you choose one file. If you want to upload a script with images or multiple scripts, then you do one directly. Like us, we have the script and we have the app icon. So we want a directory. So just choose directory. And then console window, you can all or have a console based app with no GUI, just console commands, or you can have window based like ours where it hides the console and you have an actual app and then the icon. So for the icon, I actually have one. You can just search up on Google PNG to ICO or JPEG to ICO. Just you need a dot ICO file. Uh, th this icon, by the way, is going to be like the thing down here and like on the desktop and everything. It's basically the icon self-explanatory and the additional files. So that's all the files linked to your script. So we have the app icon linked to the script. So we just choose app icon and uh, that's it. Let me just close team real quick. Uh, and then you have advanced and settings, but this doesn't really matter. Uh, and then you just do convert dot by to dot px exe sorry and uh, this might take a couple minutes even if it freezes on like one thing don't worry just wait and uh, yeah i'll just cut to the end and uh, see you again okay guys so i'm back and uh, mine's done as you can see uh, so then you just want to do open output folder you can close this and then in the folder where you have your script and everything, you should get an output. 
uh, the old the other folders th doesn't matter if they give you a .id or pycache or whatever it doesn't matter just go to the folder and then you should get something like this with a bunch of files like you don't understand anything but nothing matters here except this clicker you should see a file clicker.exe or clicker or whatever you name the app and then what you can do you can do send to desktop and then if you go to your desktop there we go clicker shortcut so now we have an app we can open it it's our icon everything and we have an auto clicker and uh, it works fine and uh, yeah so that's that's great and uh, that's basically it um, I will maybe make a, a tutorial on how to make an installer for this you could right now send this to your friends I mean not this but the file to your friends here wait, let me go back so yeah so you could send this file to your friends clicker and then all they would have to do is just put this as a shortcut and they can use it but that's kind of annoying so I'm gonna make a tutorial on how to turn any of these files into an actual installer and make a shortcut automatically on the desktop like an actual install wizard so i'll make a tutorial on that later but yeah that's basically how you turn any python script into an exe file uh which you can make a shortcut of and uh, yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i know this was pretty short but uh it was just uh easy to make so yeah see you guys next time and uh, if you want to come chill with me just uh, follow my twitch